We're back at 649 this Friday morning. For a few years, our friend Jennifer Griswold reported on a remarkable Papillion family, the Mounties. In 2019, they suffered unimaginable loss when their toddler died in his sleep. Determined to honor him, the family set out to build a playground in his name called Aces Place. The pandemic slowed them down a bit, but did not stop the Mounties, as you'll see in today's Positively the Heartland. The first Saturday of December, when it was still sweatshirt weather and the ground hadn't frozen, family and friends gathered in Lincoln. Very heartwarming, honestly. I mean, just the, the amount of people that came out and showed their support, not just here, but building the project and, and rolling the project out. It's been pretty incredible. An incredible day, more than two years in the making. After Mike and Megan Mowdy unexpectedly lost their son Ace in 2019, they vowed to ensure his name and joyful spirit lived on. It was just a couple weeks after Ace passed away. Um, we got a call from Coach Ravel telling us about this idea, and we just couldn't be more excited. We, I don't think we ever would have came up with this idea no. for ourselves. You got it? You got it. If we're talking about we want to do something for Megan and Mike, and so just through brainstorming, it's like, you know what? It makes sense to do a playground. It makes sense to do a playground here at Bowling Stadium. Number one, we don't have one. But number two, this is the last place they, they had as a family together. Mike and Megan, both former Huskers. He played football, she played softball. The Mounties attended a softball game the night before Ace passed. That's when this photo was taken. Go, big <laughs> red. On dad's shoulders, smiling at mom. The playground's actually being built almost exactly where we took our family picture that night before he passed away. And this was the Mounties' first time back at Bolin since that night. And one of the songs came on the other day and it took me like right back. I know it. Today's been emotional. I mean, it started out uh, tearful. It's we've had intermittent tears, lots of different people, whether it's Megan and Mike, whether it's the grandparents, whether it's me, whether it's alumni, um, you know, it's just, it, it's, it's a way to remember, but also to celebrate moving forward his life. That's what the Mounties want for their other son, JJ, and all children who'll visit to make happy memories here at Ace's Place. It's really hard to put into words how we really feel and our gratitude is, is immense, especially with the people that have helped it along the way um, and helped it come to fruition. Just at uh, bottom of our hearts, it, it truly means so much. While most of Ace's Place is done, a rubber surface still needs to go down. That will happen this spring, then the playground will be ready to dedicate.